Fox 55's Troyce Grant was at that protest and has the story. In front of the Allen County Courthouse, a family is seeking justice for 20-year-old Deshanae Warren Hill, who was killed Sunday by a Fort Wayne police officer. Just hours before the protest took place, the police department announced that Mark Guzman was the officer who shot Warren Hill. He's been on the force since October 2017. Now, Warren Hill's family wants him charged with wrongfully taking the 20-year-old's life. It happened Sunday when Guzman responded to a call about a fight at the area of Winchester Road and Babcock Drive. Police say Guzman believed Warren Hill was trying to run him over with her car. That's when he shot through the windshield. She was pronounced dead at the scene. Mother Denisha Warren says her daughter would not harm anyone, let alone hit an officer with her car. Her mother also mentioned the car Warren Hill was driving had issues with the power steering, so that caused her to lose control of the vehicle. Now the community is joining one another in making sure Warren Hill gets justice. The crowd marched from the courthouse to the police station chanting her name, and they are using a GoFundMe to raise money for legal fees. Warren Hill's funeral is Monday. Right now, the family is still grieving and looking for a civil attorney to represent them on this case, and we will update you here at WFFT as we learn more. In Allen County, I'm Troy Grant, Fox 55 News.